Hello. It is January 12th, and it's Zane's birthday. Happy birthday, Zane. And if you don't know who Zane Malik is, you should go find out because he's pretty cool. <laughs> this is Kirby and Shay. And um, today we are doing a story time. And we are doing. Since we have no room for Ripper. Yeah. And we are doing. Um, when we lived together, we got some really interesting stories from that time. It was like two weeks. Yeah. Um, at that time, her family was finding a new house and they were moving and whatnot. And she needed somewhere to stay for a couple weeks. And I was living with my aunt and uncle, and she, they agreed to let her stay there because she's a really good person. <laughs> That was our reasoning, so. <laughs> so she stayed with me for a couple weeks. Because, you know, I don't weeks. go to jail or do drugs. Okay. Anyways, <laughs> so our first story is, okay, yeah. I guess, I'll do the other one. I guess Shay has a thing about candles. I don't know. Oh, we just went to Walgreens one day, and she was all like, I want to get a candle. <clears throat> and so we looked at all the candles, and we smelt all of them. <laughs> You smelled more than I did. I found what I like. I'm like, this is it. <laughs> Whatever. It's one of the really big ones. <clears throat> yeah. And we found this one that smelled like Christmas. And we're like, mm-hmm. That's it. That's it. <laughs> so we got it. And every time we entered, entered the room, it smells it like Christmas. Glorious. <laughs> 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 and we, like, always had it on. It was up on the windowsill by our bed. And this leads into the next story. <laughs> next story, um, when we lived together, usually we'd stay up a little bit later. We were reading the story on Wattpad, and I'd read a chapter or two out <laughs> loud together. Um, so we, we, it was kind of like, we just read a story every night, and I finished a story, well, almost. She, she moved out, so she didn't, she doesn't know what happened, but, um, one of these nights when we were reading the story, we hear a thump on the window, and a, a cat like screeching <laughs> and the cat had tried to go through my window and grab the candle and instead face first into the window and freaked out okay I have to clear something up her window <laughs> is on ground floor cats so there do not fly. are no flying cats yes. <laughs> ground level I my room is in the basement yes okay <laughs> <laughs> you know, we lived together, so there's times that she went to work, and I told her uncle, aunt and uncle, that I like to do lawn work. She'd prefer to, prefer to do outside chores than indoor chores. Yeah. <laughs> and so, they, like, had, hadn't mowed their lawn in forever. They both work full-time jobs. What do you expect? I'm <laughs> just saying, okay? It's, just, it's, it's, it's important for the story. It's important for the, the story. The grass was long. Yes, it was very long. <laughs> and so, like... And I, so I, I mowed the lawn, and it was very hard to start, because... Because she was it, all alone, and she doesn't have any muscles. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> the grass was long, and it was really hard to cut. <laughs> and that mower was different from my mower, and like apparently like there's like this extra extra latch thing where like it makes it go it goes for you, which I'd never seen on a mower before. And for we the record, I've never heard this story. And <laughs> she was gone, and I never told her. Just whatever. But <clears throat> I kept having to go inside to get her uncle to help me out. <laughs> and I'm like, okay, the mower's being weird, and so we had. To Keep coming out to <laughs> help me with the mower. And then he, you know, laughed at me when I didn't know about that latch. I thought, like, you know, you can just press that and it'll go for you. I'm like, oh, that'd be helpful because it was uphill. <laughs> and then they have, well, everybody pretty much, most people use bags on their mowers, but we don't because it's good for the grass. And so I didn't know how to unha unlatch the bag. And I was, I was, oh, I, no, I didn't, this. I didn't ask anybody <laughs> to help me with it, because I don't want to seem really stupid, so I just looked at it, 
for like 10 minutes trying to figure it out. And then I finally found it. <laughs> I finally figured out how to do it. That's funny. The day um, she moved in, <clears throat> I left to go camping with my dad. So she was, she just moved in. I mean, she was over there quite a bit. But she just moved in. So she was there, like, all by herself for, like, four days. Three or four days. And I was like, oh, you're here? Bye. <laughs> that was funny. I have a picture of that. We'll post it on our website. I didn't have a key to the house. And his, her, his, her, that's a girl. Her what? uncle kept trying to say that they should get me a key. And that never happened. But, you know, I never had a key. But Shay did, and she was at work one day. And I got home, and the door was locked. And nobody was home to let me in. So I, I texted Shay, and she told me to use the doggy door. It's, it's like, it is not that big. It's very Tucker small. can fit through it. Yes, it is. Tucker's like this big. <laughs> it was. I didn't. I didn't want to go through the doggy door. I didn't want to at all. And so, <laughs> just get dog kisses on your way in. <laughs> it was behind me. I felt weird. Sticking my butt the whole way through. Okay, <laughs> but. <laughs> and so, but so I decided. To walk to her work, which is like two or three miles. Probably like two and a half. Two and a half miles. So I walked there and I got there and now I'm like totally exhausted and she had to get me water. And and then I realized it was getting dark outside and she didn't want me walking home alone in the dark. And I didn't want to wait until she got off because that was like two in the morning. Yeah. And so she just called up Ian and he gave me a ride home. Every morning, well, I guess it was more like afternoon for what time I woke up, but we would go upstairs and we'd turn on Netflix and watch a TV show, Friends! Wow, we just did a video about it. We would watch that together and like every morning and I eventually, she's seen the whole thing like well, all the seasons like two or three times. Uh, at that time, it was my first time watching the whole thing, so it was pretty cool. We just had this little tradition. We watched Friends in the it morning. It was like reading the book and at night. read the book at night. Yeah. <laughs> it was, it was our thing. Stories also about Ian. Um, so, <clears throat> I got home one night from work, and we were, like, Ian was already hanging out with Shay, and we were going to go do something. I don't remember what we were going to do, but we were going to go do something, and... Cl climb a church. Uh -huh. That's what it was. It was to climb a church. <laughs> that is another story. <laughs> so I just got home from work, and I didn't... I, was, I wasn't very sweaty because I don't do that much, but I want to change clothes because they were really ugly clothes. <laughs> and, he, and Ian didn't know that I was going to change clothes, but he was out of the room. And Shay just, she just closed the door and didn't warn Ian, and she didn't lock the door. <laughs> and so I was like, I was, you know, changing, and Ian walked in on me. <laughs> and I freaked out. Because, <laughs> you know, I, um... Should we tell them why this is funny? I can explain if you want. That exact... I hated the guy at the time. She is. At the time, he had been my ex for a, a while, but we were still friends, I guess. <clears throat> and so, you know, hearing all the bad boyfriend stories, I told her she hated him. And now, guess who's dating him? That's why it's funny. <laughs> Clifford! <laughs> so, a couple times, a couple nights when she was living over there, we would do some live videos, like live video chats and stuff to try and promote our YouTube channel. And there's this one that we Which is what you're watching right now. But, by the way. Um, and <laughs> there was this one that went on for like three hours. We just kind of sat and talked to random people. And there was some random requests. One guy thought I was attractive when females burped. Oh yeah. Um, a lot of people just said make out, just kiss, just do it. And we're like, 
No, we're all right, but a lot of people wanted us to do that. <laughs> Whenever I went to her house before we moved in, I would always see that, you know, her room was a complete mess. <laughs> and I was like, you know what, one day I'm going to clean this. And then, one day. And then, the, yeah. She's like, I will clean this one day. Yeah. I was like, I even had a dream I was about like, it. go for it, I'm not going to do it. <laughs> yeah. But, um, and then I moved in, and, you know, she worked a lot, and I didn't. And I needed stuff to do, and so I was like, you know what, today is the day. <laughs> today is that day. And so I cleaned everything. I even cleaned all of downstairs. Because I just cleaned everything. So crazy. Yeah. <laughs> I just, I remember walking home, I'm like, clean. you cleaned my room. And you're like, yeah, yeah I remember, I put on told you. It's like, I organized it, I cleaned it. We had a pretty good setup in our room, though. We each had our side. Yeah. With the drawers and the mini fridge. Yeah. yeah. That, that you had to steal back from. <laughs> that I had to steal back from Ian. Ian. I bought it four years ago and he never gave it back. So I stole it back. <laughs> he never used it anyway. You still have it? Yeah. I still have it. He ain't getting it back this time. And that is all we have for today. Thank you for watching and liking and commenting and subscribing. Um, please share this video with friends, family, and stuff. Um, comment down any <laughs> video ideas you have for us, if any at all. Um, <laughs> I guess we'll see you next time. I made it as a wise man. I couldn't cut it as a poor man stealing. Tired of living like a blind man.